So you've been living in Park Lane apartments about 10 years. Yeah. You moved in when you were 90, and you've been living on your own by yourself. Talk to me and tell me why that's important to you. Why is it important? To yeah, to be able to live by yourself. Because of the, we have, uh, they protect us. There's more protection here than anywhere. Because of the doorman? The doorman, yeah. So you always been a fighter, right? Yeah. Tell us about some of the times you fought for other people's rights. Uh, I mean, what? Tell me about a time that you fought for other people's oh, rights. That I fought for other people? Yes. When I was growing up, I worked at Twin Coach. I fought for the blacks to get jobs other than sweeping and cleaning and cleaning floors. And they did. You won that. Yep. Did people help you? No, nope. they were against me. Black people? Yeah, black people were against me. Why? I couldn't tell you that. They were scared. I was going to get fired. Scared they were going to get fired? Yep. You weren't scared? No. Nope. Why? No scared of me. I was a young man. <laughs> <laughs> but you're fighting now to try to get... You're fighting this apartment building. Aren't you scared now? Uh, people in the apartment? Yeah. I'm scared now. But you're not. They, they, are, they are scared, but I'm not afraid. Why aren't you afraid? Because it's not in me to be afraid. It's for me to help people. And that's how come you yeah. work? Is that how come you worked with me and Brenda to file a complaint? Uh, is that why you filed a complaint yeah. with us? To help people. That is afraid. So you've been helping people all your life. Right. And this is just one more fight. <laughs> the devil is on me. Oh <laughs> 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 uh, yeah. Well, Reverend, is there anything else you would like to say? Young people will see oh. this. Is there anything you would like to say to young people about, young black people about fighting for their rights? Be not afraid to stand up for your rights because someday you'll have to pay for, for the things that you do and do not do. And so we should just stand up for our rights yeah, right. And not be afraid of doing that. Right, don't be afraid. Reverend Moore, I love you. Uh, I love you. <laughs> no, I'm not afraid. And you inspire me. Uh, you inspire me. Right. When I grow up, I want to be like you. <laughs> no, I'm not afraid. Okay, thank you. I'm going to stop taping now. Yeah. Okay? Okay. Thank you.